Hello and welcome. Today I will be showing you the Infinity Lift version 2. It is fast and easy to use. The display shows you which floor you have selected and then the bubble elevator will bring you there. And while we're in the lift, I want to thank everyone for subscribing. It means a lot. And if you are not yet subscribed, but you like my content and you want to see more in the future, consider subscribing. Thank you. And as you can see, the lift brought us to floor number 42, just as we selected. As long as the lift is still in use, all input is locked. The lift is on long enough so you can go from the lowest floor to the highest floor with a few extra seconds to get in and out of the lift. After that, the lift resets and the input can be used again. There is also a timer connected to the input, that way if you forget to click the go button or you go away, after 2 minutes the go button gets clicked automatically, that way the input will never be stuck on one floor. There is one more feature I want to show you, and that is if you type in the wrong floor number. I wanted to go to floor number 1, but I typed 91. So, now I just need to type the correct number again, and that's all. Now let's take a quick view of the outside. I try to make it as compact as possible, so all the logic is on the bottom floor. The bubble elevator could be made as small as 3x1. And you don't need the display, but I do recommend it, so the structure can be a little bit smaller. But I think for what it does, it's pretty compact. The floor height is 7 blocks, so 6 blocks between floor and ceiling. You can of course also increase the distance between floors. This lift currently has 64 floors, from the bottom of the world to the build height limit. But if you increase the build height limit, you can have up to 100 floors. You could have even more floors if you want, but then you would need to add an extra digit to the display and change around some of the logic, but I don't think that will ever be necessary. Anyways, thank you for watching. This is by far the most complicated build I have done till now. So if you liked it, leave a like, leave a comment, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.